Hello, this is Gray Hughes. I'm putting out another video right now. This one will be um, about something else that I um, I didn't discover, but somebody pointed it out to me that is it's disturbing. You know, it adds some credence to a possible cover-up, okay, of video that's missing, all right? So whenever I see something, I put it out there. Now, if you're somebody like you know, well, I won't even say their names, but the other YouTubers, every single video they ever make is all supporting their theory. Now, people ask me, well, why do you, why, why are all your videos debunking something? And I say, because I, I can, and I shouldn't be able to debunk something so easily. Okay. I, every single thing that I debunk is simple. And it, because the reason it's simple is because what I'm debunking is not true. All right. That's why it's easy to do. Okay, now this video today is about a camera, another camera that should have filmed Kanika in her last portion of her nine minute walk. And it's right there, okay? I hadn't even realized, I didn't even look there because on Rosemont never mentioned this one, okay? And I'm almost 100% sure that that is a camera. And what, we're, what we'll do first is we'll play the walkthrough from right here and you'll see now I'll point out where all the cameras should have been that would have captured her all right so this camera right here would have picked her up walking and this camera filmed down this hall there right and then I'm going to pause it right here this camera right above the freight elevator would have filmed her either go into the freight elevator shout out to Mike Mecca or up the stairs that, that's right there. I believe she went up the stairs. Okay, now here's the stairs and at the top of the stairs, I think uh, my mouse is taking over. I'm actually playing a video that I'd already made. All right, so, so she goes up these stairs and this camera right here wasn't working okay now if you notice see how the lens is on the left hand side and the light is above it to the left and the power cord comes out the bottom right now this camera above the freight elevator the lens is on the right hand side okay now in this case the power would be coming out the bot out the top okay now let's go all the way into the kitchen now notice this one the, the lens is on the right and the light is on the bottom bottom right and the power comes out of the bottom that, that's just because they flipped the camera over I don't know what the advantage of that is maybe they didn't have enough wiring so they had it come through the bottom and then you can just flip the camera over I'm not sure if you, you do that in the software or where you actually do that part but you would be flipping the image over okay all right so now let's go back to, let me show you why I believe that this is a camera. All right, so there it is right there, okay? These are the double doors that Kanika came through after all, already going to and falling over the, the stairs, you know, the stair rail, catching herself. Then she comes back through this way, and these are those chairs right there, uh, right there, those chairs. So right now in this image, she'd be standing about right there. And this looks like a camera here, everybody. I mean, notice the, the lens is on the left-hand side. Now watch this. You can even see the light. I'll make it easier to see. Can you see that? There's the light right there. And the lens is on the left-hand side, and the power is coming out of the bottom. Okay, so I'm almost 100% sure that that is a camera. And that would be filming down that hallway. All right, now there's another thing I wanted to address was that this camera right here, I thought maybe it was, and, and I did use the word maybe in my other video, that maybe they turned this one on, they fixed it prior to this walkthrough here, okay? But uh, it was pointed out to me that this was actually a photograph from the 9th or 10th, but this guy made a, a full video. I mean, some guy named, uh, I don't know, something, something two cents, you know, because that's about what his videos are worth. He uh, he was telling me that 
He's, he did a whole a 10 minute video on how I lied to everybody by saying that this camera was fixed um, before, you know, I guess what would it be like just before the walkthrough? Okay. But it, in reality, it looks like it was probably running uh, the next day. So basically what Rosemont said is they gave a date that they fixed the camera. I don't know if it was three or four days, five days later. Okay, but this photo that this shot is from was only a day or two after Kanika walked up here. Okay, so this can't be one of the cameras that they fixed. And I said, maybe this is the camera. You know, I, I didn't say it was a fact. But the thing is, when I say something, and it's a maybe, people take it as a fact. You know, they try to discredit me when I say something. Like, if I speculate at all, it's it's horrible. But... Every single one of their videos, it's all speculation and nobody ever asks them about it. So you got to ask yourself why that is, okay? So when I see something that's a discrepancy, I put it out there, okay? So you've seen videos where I talk about pixelation. I called Flowtech, uh, uh, not Flowtech, um, Vivotech up. Flowtech's an oil company. It was a good stock to buy a while back. But anyways, Vivotech is, uh, you know, they said that it's possible to edit out a motion from a specific type of, you know, like a hard drive, not an NVR system. Okay, that's that's what they told me. Now, because something's possible doesn't mean it did happen, right? Everyone can agree with that. Okay, but what I am saying is that I think it's a little strange now that we have three cameras all from like literally from right here from this position to right here three cameras prior to this camera that would have all shown where she was going that did not work and that seems pretty coincidental you know like that's not um and it, it's bothersome too that they didn't mention this camera it's not mentioned as one of the ones that didn't work I, I've never even seen footage. I purchased the external hard drive. Again, it cost me it's 50 bucks for the external hard drive with the videos, and it cost 17 more dollars for shipping, so 67 total, and it's way faster. You don't have to download anything. You can just look right through it, and that's why I have all the clear footage, and it's easy for me to find stuff, and it doesn't take me that long to put something together. All right? But it's strange. I mean, even in that footage, this camera is not there, okay? And it's not mentioned as one of the ones that, that doesn't work. And it appears that there is a light on. Now, having the light on doesn't mean it's actually storing video. It just means that there's, um, you know, power being sent to the camera or maybe it sensed motion. But it doesn't mean that video is being recorded somewhere that could be where the when it's when they say it's not working it could just be that it's not actually saving the video anywhere but the camera itself might be functional all right uh, there's there are two different things they don't the cameras do not store the data locally they they're, those wires that you see are wires to some recorder possibly the nvr that i was talking about and in that case you cannot remove the motion data all right all right well so let's just play that one last time just so you can see so after she comes back through these double doors she heads down this way and when when she gets about right there this camera would have picked her up so we're talking all the last minute and a half of her walk three cameras weren't working so this one would have picked her up then this one and then she goes up the stairs right here so that's two that weren't working and here's the third now this one would have only picked up the top of her head i think i might have mentioned that earlier and then she goes through those double doors and then when she goes into the the kitchen that last shot was filmed from here this camera is the one that actually then picks her up walking back to the cooler area okay so there you have it and listen 
the people that watch my videos and appreciate them know that they can trust me to put out information regardless of how it fits my position, okay? And I wish we could say that for all the other YouTubers because that just isn't the case. All right, so until next time, I will talk to you later.